Hi, I'm Jimmy Chang, and we're here to talk about how to find triangulation from trigonometry. Now, just to be sure that you want to be comfortable with triangulation, you want to think about what the definition is. What you're trying to do is you're trying to determine the exact location of a point, and how you do that through triangulation is you want to measure angles from two other points that you already know through a fixed baseline. So, hypothetically, suppose you've got a triangle, And suppose you want to find the distance to this particular point. Let's just call this uh, D. Suppose that's the point that you're not sure about. Okay. Now, as you might imagine, you have right angles here. And suppose that you have this as your fixed baseline. Let's, let's call this thing B, B for baseline. Now, what you're doing here is you're measuring angles to that point from angles that you already know. So let these two be the points that you already know, but let's talk about the angles that you already have, hopefully will be given. Let's call this thing alpha, and let's call this angle beta. Now, there's a formula that you actually want to use to try to figure out the distance of this particular point, so let's go right to it. You have D is equal to the baseline that you already know, B, and then times sine of alpha, times sine of beta over sine of alpha plus beta. So what you're basically doing here is to find the distance of that particular point, you want to take the baseline that you're already given times a sine of that alpha angle times a sine of the beta angle and divided by the sine of the measures of the two angles added together. Now what you want to be careful about is you want to be consistent in determining if alpha and beta are in both degrees or both in radians because you cannot mix and match otherwise you'll get the wrong kind of value that you're looking for. But basically once you know these values you can just plug them in and you'll find the exact location of that particular missing point. So I'm Jimmy Chang and that's an introduction on triangulation from trigonometry.